sobbing of a girl echoing in the midnight bathroom. <laughs> the soft sound of water dripping. All these stops when someone approaches. Hanako-san knows that foolish people wander into this place. Is anyone there? Hanako-san is waiting for someone to knock the door. And always hoping Hanako-san to drag the target into the dark. Hoping for that moment. Hanako-san in the bathroom. A famous scary story told at schools. Red skirt and a bob are typical depictions of her. The details of the story differ from region to region, such as she was killed at a bathroom or she fell from a window. And rumors about Hanako-san exist at my school too. Hey, do you know? The girls' bathroom on the third floor at our school is haunted. Oh, really? Do you know the Hanako-san in the bathroom? Yeah, it's the girl ghost in the girls' bathroom, right? There was a girl named Hanako at this school before. But she was bullied and was forced to pretend to be the Hanako-san in the bathroom. But she couldn't bear the bullying and killed herself. Since then, you can hear a girl sobbing and water dripping at the midnight bathroom, even though no one's there. If you knock on the third door three times and call Hanako-san's name, you get dragged inside. But her features change every couple of years. The clothes is always red, but her hairstyle changes. I wonder why. By the way, these couple of years, her hair is short. It's because someone made up a random story, right? We don't have Hanako-san at our school. We can't be sure of that. Why? A couple of years ago, there was a girl in middle school who disappeared, right? I heard that girl got lost while visiting the school at night. She probably got taken away by Hanako-san. Well, I'm not sure about that. But why are you telling it to me now? Yes. We're at a school and it's already nighttime. But it's not because we came to see if Hanako-san exists. Our school has the custom of arranging sports camps at our school during summer break. The classrooms that are used for the camps are fixed. And students take turns using them. Today was the first day of our camp. No one would want to go to the bathroom after hearing that. Don't worry, it's the second floor here. I still don't feel good about it. We'll have to go to the bathroom together for a while. That's how the summer camp started. But things went quite smoothly. And it was already our final day. But something happened that day. What? Why is the softball members here? Wait, why are the baseball team here? It appears that our teacher made a mistake and our camp day overlapped. We discussed it over and our team ended up moving to another classroom because it was our last day. That night, we were tired, so we went to sleep early. But around midnight, I woke up. <sighs> this sucks. I drank too much water before going to sleep. Everyone's sleeping. 
I have no choice. I'll have to go to the bathroom alone. Walking the school hallway alone at night was creepy, but because of the many days of hard training, I was more sleepy than scared. <sighs> As I reached the bathroom, I quickly tried to enter the closest stall. Then, I felt a warm breeze sweep my cheek. Oh, the window's open! At the same time, I realized that one of the stall's door was closed. Oh yeah, I think I heard something while I was walking the hallway. Is anyone there? I called out, but there wasn't a single sound. Maybe someone's passed out inside. No, that can't be, but... No one's there. For a while, I was trying to pick up sounds, but I suddenly felt a chill. At that moment, I was no longer sleepy, and I remembered something. Wait, this is... what floor? This is... which stall? Hey, maybe the person inside is... Hanako-san? <gasps> I'm not sure which one was faster. Me trying to escape, or the door opening. In any case, my foot that was about to escape was grabbed by someone. No! Stop! Let me go! Someone, help! And... Please, someone... A girl who had disappeared a couple of years ago was found dead at a middle school. According to the investigators, her body had no scars, but her clothes was dyed red and she had bled to death. Her skin was pale white. That sounds creepy. Yeah, and why was she found years later? Sobbing of a girl echoing in the midnight bathroom. <laughs> the soft sound of water dripping. All these stops when someone approaches. I now know the reason why. She's crying because she's sad that she's cursed into this place. The sound of the water dripping is not from the faucet but the sound of her tears. She stops crying because she's happy that the moment has come. Are you really going? <laughs> I'm nervous. Hanako-san knows that foolish people wander into this place. Look, the door is really closed. Hanako-san is waiting for someone to knock on the door. Here we go. And always hoping. Hanako-san. To drag the next Hanako-san into the dark and to be able to free herself. She's hoping for that moment. Rose! Rose! Ugh, she's the one who called me. Where is she? Is she in the bathroom? Wah! Hey, what? Huh? Wah! <laughs> I'll go out to play. Hey, Rose. Did you finish cleaning the bathroom? I see. She wanted me to clean the bathroom for her. Ugh, playing little tricks like this. 
I don't care if she gets scolded by the real Hanako-san. Oh, I'm starting to feel chills. It's just my imagination, right? <laughs>